Hey guys, what's going on? It's Don here from Nova Spare Tech and welcome back to the channel. And today we're gonna run a command that you should never run on your Linux computer. So let's get started. Now this is something I always wanted to test it in my years of using Linux, which is rm command on your root directory. So uh, we're gonna be testing that out to see what will actually break. Will it break actually during the whole process of using everything or it's just gonna look like it did nothing but nothing will run because technically everything runs in memory anyway, so it might do that. Now the command that we are gonna be issuing is something called rm-rf slash. So, it's gonna look something like this. Let's see. RM dash RF slash. RM means to remove file, R means to recursive, and F means to be forceful. And since slash is your root directory, it's gonna delete everything under that root directory, which is your home folder, system folder, etc, user bin, everything. So I've never done this before, and I think it's gonna be a short one, but um, yeah, let's see how this goes. Now, I am testing this on my uh, Zima board right over here, which is my testing platform when I was installing Hyperland and Arch Linux before I installed it into this machine. So I'm not erasing my main machine, my workbench. It's just this little test machine that I have set up. So let's see what happens. Okay, so obviously it's gonna need sudo. So let's drop that in. So sudo rm-rf slash and get the password in there. Uh, dangerous operation. No preserve root override this fail safe feature. Is that new? Uh, it must be new because I don't remember that. No preserve root. Error, no such file in home directory. This is popping up. It's removing everything. Can't remove proc because that's part of the system. It loads in. Um, devices you can't uh, remove. So slash dev you can't remove. Um... I can't even type anything in here afterwards. So I can't even list the structure of what's going on. Is this it? Can I load more? I can't load any more. I could still press enter over here. So I'm gonna let this run. So it technically finished up. That's still in memory. So I should still be able to see stuff. Permission denied, said command. Everything's broken now. said nothing com no command can be found bash is gone so i can't even use that oh so df that's another program that's gone i can't check anything because there's no programs everything's like absolutely destroyed i could still press that if i highlight it will i still see cores yeah those are loaded into memory my network manager nope that won't even come up in oh it actually does my network manager is here Clock, calendar, calendar, the fonts are all messed up. This is not going to work. Right clicking should give me my pulse audio uh, or pipe wire, but that didn't work. And that is it. I can't even reboot because that's not a command. Yeah, basically everything is done. Command not found. Nothing is found. Now, if I was to reboot this machine, let's see what happens now. All right, it's going to go into Zima. The only thing that should load might probably be systemd because that's on a whole different drive. There you go. Reboot, select, proper do, insert, boot, medium. No, it's even gone. That's everything's gone. All right. So that is the quickest way to format your computer or format your Linux computer. And I didn't know that was a new command with the no preserve, but that's something new I've never seen before. Anyway, that is it for this video. I was going to keep it short. I just wanted to see what will happen if we run this command, and there we have it. If you guys have any questions, hit me up down in the comments below. And if you guys are new to this channel, consider subscribing and also hitting that bell notification icon so you know when the next video is going to be out. And as I say, my Nerd Cave, hack till it hurts.